Path to Sky is a multi-platform project. We're making a very important and very engaging four-hour television series. But at the same time, we're producing mobile games, and we are making a social networking game on Facebook. Facebook games are really special in the gaming world. There are women in their 30s and 40s, even up to 50, who might be playing for the first time. And the numbers are really big. Farmville is one of the most uh, successful games on Facebook. The whole idea is that as you make progress, you need to invite other people to complete quests or different challenges. And for us, this idea that you can actually play with your friends and invite them is the main reason we chose Facebook for Half the Sky. What could be more ideal than a game that is all about recruiting more people into this global movement? You are going to meet Radhika. She's an Indian woman, and you're going to take her on a journey from oppression to opportunity. We start in India. We go to Kenya, Vietnam, Afghanistan, and the U.S. Radhika will be your gateway into meeting other women and their situations in these other countries. And all those challenges is a quest you need to complete. Some of them would be around maternal health, some of them around education, economic empowerment. It could be a quest around gender-based violence you can actually take action that will affect people in the real world. The way we're doing it is that we collaborate with some of the leading NGOs in the world. Room to Read, GEMS, UN Foundation, Tosten, Heifer International, World Vision, One, and the Fistula Foundation. At the end of a quest, we give you the option to donate real money to those NGOs, and it's always connected to the gameplay. So, for example, if you need to get a virtual goat in order to complete your quest, you also have the option to give a real goat and donate it through Effort International. We're making substantive change along the way. We are making a game that will engage millions of players. A win for us would be greater interest, greater conversation, public discourse around issues facing women and girls worldwide.